Blessings to you, child of God. Blessings to you, family. I welcome you all to this session in Jesus' mighty name. If this is your first time on this channel, you're welcome. If you're a returning viewer, you're welcome. I love you all so much and I keep praying for you. If you have a special prayer request, do send to my Gmail. Check out the description section. You will see my Gmail there. Send your prayer request. Let me trust God with you. I believe that prayers work. And I know, I have tested and I have seen that God answers prayers. So I want to join my faith with yours. And trust God that he will give you the answers that you seek. And God will definitely answer your prayer and you will testify. In Jesus' name, amen. You're walking towards a trap. That's the word I received in my spirit. And as I was trying to understand this word, God is saying, someone you're walking towards a trap. I shared this word before and the Spirit of God laid in my heart again. You know, the devil is leading you towards a trap and you have to be very careful. What is this trap? Recently, you have faced some challenges that have made you to doubt God, to doubt the very existence of God, to doubt the presence of God. And the Lord is sending me to tell you that that's the trap of the devil. Because you see, the main aim, the main plan of the enemy is to make you doubt the word of God. The word of God has the power to make you, to transform you into whoever you want to be and whoever God wants you to be that you never even imagined you could be. So when the devil sees this, he knows that the only way is for him to deceive you, not to believe in the word of God. When God says it, believe it and it will come to pass. The Bible says the word of God never goes out and comes back the same. Because he must accomplish the purpose for which it was sent. I know you have received prophetic messages. You have received prayers. You have received promises from the word of God. And sometimes you want to doubt because it's not yet visible in your life. Do not doubt. Don't fall into that trap. Believe God. You will receive your answer. The devil deceived Eve in the Garden of Eden to doubt the word of God. He said, did God say you should not eat this fruit? He kept some doubt in her mind. The moment doubt stepped in, sin followed and the devil took authority. But that will not be your portion in the name of Jesus. God has revealed this so that you don't fall into that trap. No matter what happens, hold on to the word of God. No matter the political, social situation, no matter what is happening in your marriage, in your business, at your job site, hold on to the word of God. God is able, he's willing and he will save you hallelujah now i pray for you in the name of jesus that god's hand of protection is activated over your life i pray for you he will not fall into the trap of the enemy no matter the situation no matter the circumstance god's word will be re-echoed in your mind i pray that god will give you the grace to go through every challenge and at the end of the day may he receive the glory in jesus mighty name you are blessed you are protected the hand of god is upon you you are not alone Amen. May the Lord bless you and keep you. May he cause his face to shine upon you and be gracious to you. May our good Lord look kindly on you and grant you his peace. I love you so much. Shalom.